I ran the tack wires through some flex split tubing and chose to mount the tack right here in the middle of my dash using some command strip velcro stick on hangers. It makes it real easy to push it on, push it off. I can move it out of the way to see the hour meter and just set it back. What I really like about this is when it comes time to wash the tractor I can easily detach the tack and tuck it away in behind the radiator here or behind the dash rather and don't have to worry about it getting wet or I can just place it back here if I don't want it out at all. Nice little handy no mar installation. The command strips is a stretch adhesive so if you want to just completely take it off you simply grab the adhesive, pull on it, it stretches out, pops off, it leaves no gummy mess, no marks, nothing. So I don't do any damage to Big Green with this tack installation. I run the flex tubing up over the dash and under the hood right where the handle cutout is. I run the tubing to the right, just down the top of the radiator, and then all the excess wire hangs down between the radiator and the air intake, just on the inside under the hood. I then ran the flex tubing through the opening for the radiator overflow vent and down the block connecting the positive lead to the positive terminal on the alternator and then went a little further down and found a motor mount bolt where I secured the ground connector for the power to the tack. On the other side where the sensor is I put it around the injector tube and then run the negative for the sensor down and also connected it to a motor mount bolt. 